A No Man's Sky is a game full of exploration. Fuck me. <laughs> Man, my guy's ruining my intro. No Man's Sky is a game full of exploration. And today, I want to kind of explore some more planets. I've been running a lot of missions, you know, doing stuff like building bases, doing very specific things in game to get stuff done. But today, we're going to take it a step back. I want to try to find a really cool creature, something that I can like ride or race with, you know? So we're going to see how it goes. Let's uh, hop into our spaceship. I currently have one free slot for a companion so we're gonna go check out a few different planets see uh what we can find and ideally i'm gonna be doing this in pirate systems because i'm low on nanites and i figured out a really cracked way to make nanites which i'll show you guys in a minute so we're gonna go hop out let's look around let's go over to this uh mining pirate system and then i'm gonna go to the space station right away oh of course of course i've got a uh, what a pirate battle to do or is that just a random would it disappear? You, you guys saw that, right? I'm not tripping. Well, what? Okay. Well, I'm not going to complain. We're going to go inside. But as I was saying, each companion in game, like at this point, I can get like three sheets or I can have 18 companions. I have eight slots unlocked, but each slot costs 20k nanites. So I need to make like oh, almost 200k nanites. Now, I was thinking runaway mold farm or, you know, something uh, normal in game, but uh, I kind of figured out. That, yeah, there's a way easier way to do that. As always, I'm gonna grab all the words that I can learn from them and then give away gifts. I have a bunch of them right now, so I'm just like trying to spam it as fast as possible. This game's all about multitasking. Even though we're gonna be exploring, living it up today, you know, I I'm still dedicated to, to grind. Look, we learned a word for gel. Now we can buy hair gel. Now, the way we're gonna do this is actually quite simple. You can also go to the scrap uh, dealer, but I think that's a little bit more time consuming than just normal units. Ooh, nip nip buds. Finally, dude, like, look, I, I was looking for Nip Nip Buds a whole video. I found, like, 12 in the video. There's seven right there. That's crack. Anyways, though, these suspicious packets with the goods, the uh, tech, and then the arms, that cost me, like, two mil units right there. And now, we're just gonna go ahead, open up all of these. Uh, not really... Yeah, don't think any of these I want to keep or like any of them I really need to use. We also have salvaged glass that we can open up. Pretty much going to try to open up everything right now. Is there any extra technology that we get like this stuff could be really good. Forbidden exosuit module. Ooh, I do I do kind of want to try those out, the forbidden ones. They might be even better than the suspicious. Who knows? Okay, okay, let's throw one on. Let's see. Oh yeah, no, I have a few on. This one's shit though. <laughs> so dismantle that one. But with these ones, if you don't install them, you can see they're worth like 300, 400, 900 nanites. That is good stuff, you know? Um, I'm going to move like the B-class reactor. I don't think there's really much else that I want to keep. It's really just that. But then, let's see. Right now, I'm at 10k nanites. Okay, and, um, some of this stuff is from before. So starting from 10k and 600, going up to... I'll buy a scanner module and try it out. See if it's better than the ones I have right now. And ooh, yo, that one's cracked. That one's really good, bro. That's good stuff, man. So look at that. 10k on each bonus that we scan compared to this one, which has 6 to 7k. Plus, we have a 45% scan radius. Yeah, we're going to be dismantling that one and then moving that. Let's definitely put that guy there to get him supercharged. Now look at that. 12k. It's 13k that's really insane okay cool so we got something productive done i made a bunch of nanites from that let's get out of here because now we're gonna look around okay we're gonna go check out the planets and see what kind of life forms that we can find around here ideally uh contaminated planet yeah I i'm gonna look around try to find out which one will be the best uh candidate dinosaurs robots you know there's a lot of potential in game for companions icy even that like i might want to check out that icy planet it does look nice as hell bro poisonous planet <laughs> quagmire planet what the fuck is quagmire planet like family guy okay i guess we have to go check out that one i don't know what the hell is gonna be there i also really need facium for the uh, nip nip farm that's going on on our freighter so that'll be big help as well oh anomaly detected what emergency containment device what is this i have never seen this before in game what the fuck do i shoot at it I guess. There we go. Ominous tentacle. What? what kind of hen four eye stuff did I just pick up, dog? Oh, cool. Okay. It's worth a little bit of money. It's worth it. Okay, cool. Back to Family Guy Planet. <laughs> awesome. It's going to be brain dead. Watch, watch, watch there be like some, some clapped animals here. All right. Let's pick a spot down here to land at and uh, we'll see what we're dealing with. It is 
pretty grim here dog <laughs> um yeah no s-class clouds i'll look for those as well as i'm uh traveling about but yeah we're getting like a nice bonus now to some of these like 100k for scanning down plants that's insane man so right there we've made our money back from all the nanites that uh i basically converted you know let's go check out some of the life forms what do we got what is this what is this fucking ball of oh no thank you dog <laughs> we'll try something else yo is that hey you come back here you come back here i kind of like you man what, what the hell look at him what is this it, it it really reminds me of you know the like final fantasy cactus Especially, like, I was playing FF14 a bit ago. So, wow. What a, what a creature. Okay, we gotta get this guy, man. We gotta get him. I love him. It's adopt as companion. Awesome. We got him. Hey, <laughs> look. He's got a backpack now. Sweet. Okay, we gotta give him creature pellets. We can ride this one. Oh, yeah. We can use him in a race. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Here we come. <laughs> come fuck with me, boy. This is crack, too. He's not even that slow. He's kind of fast. Like, you see these leaps he's doing? <gasps> no, 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 no. Don't, don't leap off the fucking cliff, buddy. No, 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 no. Stop right there. Okay, okay. <laughs> we'll jetpack back up. But yeah, that's sick. We already found a cool one. I don't want to stop there, though. We got to get, we got to get a few more, you know? Let's see what else we got. We got some other guys coming around the areas now. What is that thing? Okay, some kind of land monstrosity. Yo, Quagmire Planet is fucking lit. Like, it is a dead barren wasteland here, to be fair. Look at how flat this land is, though. This is like the perfect spot. What is that guy? Orange dude. Get over here. You blob. <laughs> Look at this blob guy. This is insane, bro. I don't know if I'll recruit him. I don't I don't like him like as much as the uh, cactus fellow, but some there's some potential here, bro. Is that a ship down there? <laughs> what? What is this location, dog? Quagmire planet off the hook. Oh, nearby life form is here. Ah, oh, he needs to be saved. I see. Here, I'll offer to investigate. Yeah, we'll pick it up. Maybe, maybe we'll find some more cool stuff. Oh, wait. It, did I really just repair it that fast? I, I I think I did. I must have had the resources on me to uh, g get it repaired right away. Okay, let's talk to this guy. Wave farewell. Yeah, there we go. In a standing increased. Booyah. Now, what is over here? Dung sample. I thought that was a piece of doo-doo. Basium. Oh, nice. I, I need that. Come here, guy. G give me your poo-poo. I think there's way better ways to collect facium in-game, though, than just, you know, going up to animals like a fucking farmer get getting poo-poo. So I think I'm gonna chase it that much, you know? I'm not I'm not gonna be a poo-poo chaser. Now, wait, what the fuck is that? It, it just despawned. It went away, but it looked gnarly. Hopefully, I find another one soon. But yeah, I think I got most of the stuff here scanned down. Wow, yeah, I made like 10 mil just from the scans on this planet. So that new scanner upgrade was set. A lot of times, you do burn out with them, you know, but if you stick to it, you do good. I do see a facium deposit down there. So before we leave this planet, let's go over there. I definitely want to try to gather some. That way, when we go back to the freighter, we can expand our nip-nip farm empire. Oh my god, it doesn't help this facium thing is at like the worst spot ever oh okay literally gotta work our way over to it man it's brutal i believe we need like 20 facium to uh plant one nip nip bud so uh yeah i'll get as much as this at least as i can oh my god what, what's going on cactus guy calm down i need home slice to like go away or something dude he is so distracting oh my god dude cactus dude is like so rough right now he's he's always been the death of me keeps popping up back here respawn look he's back again up there now every time i turn around he's, he's right there dude you know what i mean like <laughs> so we got one companion that's worthwhile i gotta at least get one more though you know i love him but uh <laughs> not really the impressive type of companion i was like thinking i was gonna get what the fuck it's just falling a tiny hole in the mountain okay now something does compel me to uh mark my territory here i gotta put down a base computer because this place is like so flat i mean i think it has a lot of potential for the creature race course but we'll see you know i'll put it down i'll name it let's claim base it's gonna do an overall scan i'm gonna call this the family guy base <laughs> Where's the planet name? I gotta change the planet. Yeah, there we go. Discovered by me. Awesome. So I'm f in full right to change the name of it. Rename and upload. This is gonna be fa Family Guy Land. Awesome. Oh, fuck. No, that was a system name. Okay. Well, here we go. F planet Quagmire. I'm sure someone will love that. Motherfuckers love Family Guy. 
but I'm about done on this planet. I might check out the icy planet before we go to another system. Because it did look really cool. Like, it definitely piqued my interest. But there we go. At least we got Cactus Guy and a, uh, a potential Family Guy-themed base. Fucking cursed, bro. Let's see if we got the same potential at this uh, icy planet down here. And, oh, what the fuck? Did I really just come across a freighter? What What the fuck do I do <laughs> with this one? It was a different one. You know, I haven't seen these ones. Is there loot on it? Oh, cargo pod. I see. A oh, fucking like few hundred gold. Okay, I'm not I'm not digging about for this. Oh, oh, it was a trap. No fucking doubt, bro. No doubt. Where is this scum fuck? We're gonna get him. I got like four AI companions too, so I'm like not worried about this dick flip shooting me. Maybe we'll go to a different pirate system. We'll say fuck Vicey Planet. There we go, locked on. Boom, dealt with. Who's next? And there we go. That guy's dealt with. Let's get the fuck out of here, man. Bullshit. Pirate planet. Or pirate system. Let's go to the next pirate system. That's what I'm talking about. Right here. Because, yeah, I want to go stop by the uh, space station. I have to anyways. I can't stop at a uh, planet. If I do right now, I won't have enough units to uh, unlock the extra slot that I need for the companion. So, yeah, this will be, like, I think the best route to do that. I mean, you guys saw I scanned one planet. We're at 168 mil now. Let's go over to this outlaw system and let's see how much uh, units this makes because this would be based off of like a fresh inventory, no extra technology from uh, the previous like playtime. All right, let's see what this guy has for us. Of course, he has a couple nip nip buds as well. Like religiously, they're going to carry them now. Now that I sell them, of course, they'll have them. But he didn't have as much tech as uh, before. I'll also get the runaway mold because, you know, I can turn that rusted metal, refine it, you know, all into nano eventually but then all we gotta do is go to our inventory find the items god man it's so cluttered right now yeah here we are okay so let's open these up let's get as much technology as we can and just with what i picked up there yeah it's not much but you know quick uh 1500 nanites and that one was like yeah like i said not much there so we might have to go to one more station that's all right though i'll go check it out yeah as you can see like i could purchase uh stuff from him as well with tainted metal of a scrap dealer but i don't think this is worth it this is so expensive so I'll go down to one more system and then i should have enough units from that or uh nanites to get one more companion slot oh okay here we're we're at a pirate attack okay these aren't too bad i i did learn that a, uh, you can disable the engines, I guess, on these. And then, uh, yeah, you'll be able to, like, claim the freighter. I do have a really nice one already that, uh, yeah, I'd, <laughs> I'm not looking to get rid of. So keep that in mind for, like, a different playthrough. Or if you run into these, you know, yourself. Uh, now, the civilian freighter is a, uh, yeah, their shield's almost gone. But so is the pirate shield now. So now it's just these fuel rods that we gotta get. And once we destroy these, it should start to, yeah, try to flee. But we should be able to do enough damage to uh, prevent that. It'll give us another upgrade for our own freighter at the very least. And boom. There we go. Oof. Okay. We, we got that done. Let's start scanning these planets at least while I'm here. See what kind of potential we have. Oh, 700k units. Yo, we got the nanite boost, I think, from that. Easy stuff. Okay, now let's go over to the outlaw station over here and check it out. That did bring us up to 20k. Okay, cool. I'm still going to stop quick, grab extra units, and then we'll go and try to find one more really cool companion. Oh my god. Every system has nip nip buds now. Just wild, man. Eight arms uh, things, six tech packets, though. Yeah, that right there is a way better haul. So I'm going to go and pop all of those open now. That'll give us a bunch of different types of uh, tech and whatnot. Doesn't look like anything I need to uh, keep or I'm looking out for. So cool. We can get rid of it. And this should be a like lot more nanites. Oh, yeah. There we go. Wow. Fucking... 4,000 nanites just from one system hop. That is cracked, man. Like, yeah, I don't I don't think I need to set up a runaway mold farm. I'm good, man. So now, if I go into my uh, companion register, yeah, I should be able to unlock one more slot right there. Here, I name this guy Cactus Jack. There we go. And now, let's try to go find one more planet with some cool guys. We got a ultra marine planet here. I'm not sure what that means. But, well, we're gonna land and find out at least. <laughs> Looks like there's some building edge over here. Nice stuff. And, oh, it's one of these fucking black and white planets. Brings you back to the 1920s. Wow, and there's a mofo living in here? Really? 
<laughs> okay. Wait, what a spot. Whoa! Dreams of Zeal. S-Class multi-tool. That's pretty cracked. Um, yeah, let's get rid of one of ours. I'm, I'm sure I have a shit multi-tool somewhere. Overlord of Matter. Uh, A-Class. Oh, no. Not that impressive. Loop Engine Mark VI. Yeah, I think it's about time. Oh, no. If I have to get rid of one, at least. I'm gonna try to buy this one. Oh, nice. I can buy an add to collection. Cool. Yeah, let's do it. There we go. We got a warrior here to talk to. <laughs> do you want to be my companion? I'll feed you some creature pellets, dog. Oh, he's giving us a choice. Um, Let's get multi-tool upgrades for 15k. There we go. He gave us a shitty mining module. If I could, I would attack him. Trust. Ooh, suspicious packets. There's a, there's a technology merchant back here tucked away. Okay, not much in the building, but whoa. We already got something to look at. What is this dude? Jeez, man, he looks fuck tweaked dude he, he's tweaking out i'm i'm not i'm not gonna recruit him rule number one you gonna be my companion in no man's sky you cannot be tweaked out oh look it one of those fuck man i love it oh wait i'm using the wrong fucking multi-tool i was wondering for a moment there like why i was getting nothing for scans wild let's take a look at this guy um let's offer it food hello we can harvest its nectar that's interesting yeah, it's a flower creature Look, i really do want to adopt it as a companion but let's look around first just make sure you know i'm not missing out on uh much other potential like, oh, no, i don't know i do like him he's interesting but I, fe I feel like we got more potential you know i can always come back and try to get a uh flower creature there's a petrified planet yeah i'm not sure like how much potential we're gonna have with these ones high energy planet hmm no, no, it's got high energy we'll, we'll see there we are let's go and land and <laughs> nice <laughs> another building this is not a warm welcome these planets love me bro all right we got high security in this planet though let's uh this better not be another s tier okay thank the lord we got too many multi-tools already the benefit though is that we can go here pick up more suspicious goods like arms and tech packets yeah the place i was at before had way more that's all right you know it's better than nothing we'll see what warrior uh has for us oh he wants ammunition okay we'll give uh carbon and uh he gives us nanites nice good exchange start to look around we got some birds in the area we got a uh <gasps> s-class fucking mineral deposit that's what i'm talking about dude i love to see it let's go check out what it is please be something i don't already have here we go analyzing hotspot let's see what we got salt oh that's fucking great actually yo passive salt oh i can turn it into chlorine makes so much money okay we gotta put down a base computer around here then yeah i am a super big fan of this find this is good like i said it's always worth checking you know just in case so I'll place down a base computer i'm gonna go on to it and then i'm gonna make sure that i claim base and then i'm gonna rename it so that i know this is the s class uh salt mine there we go i got the uh base named and uh yeah now let's go back to looking for creatures i don't see that many got these weird guys down there i do kind of want to get a closer look at them oh whoa whoa i like this guy more he's kind of clean for the uh flower design hey come back come back calm down let me check you out <laughs> harvest nectar um yeah i just like i like it's uh, like the head the uh little blue thing on it. it it is a bit small i will say that for a creature i don't know no it's kind of my size adopt as companion let's do it new creature adopted booyah let's uh, let's go look at what could have been though oh what the fuck is that did it hurt me for oh no that was the hazardous plant i was like did it did it hurt me that fuzzy thing all right so let's go on and ride hell yeah yeah look at this go man <laughs> cape in the wind and stuff hell yeah he is cool but i don't know i i i feel like I, I gotta find one more really cool guy yeah there are a lot of wacky guys around here like look at this dude the fuck is that it's brutal that's what it is you know <laughs> whoa this guy looks hey, i kind of like this guy he's he's fucking oh what an ugly face get a bit closer oh man what the fuck what's wrong with him <laughs> yeah then we'll go to one more planet you know we'll go check it out see uh if we can find anything else that's cool i do have quite a bit of technology now so maybe i'll just go to the next pirate system see if we get enough nanites to get one more companion on our register oh, of course we got sentinels scanning us get out of here leave me alone i want no beef right now homie i'm good thumb in our 
ship. Let's get that flip flop out of here. I don't want to say flip flop. Pretty sure I said like the I said fuck in like the first five seconds of a video. All right. So just like last time, we're going to back out to galaxy map. Try to find another pirate system. There we go. We'll go right here. And then I'll stop on the coolest planet in this system. Harsh blue globe. It's a fucking name for a planet. Lost blue planet. Ooh. <laughs> Blue WD WD land. I hate going through asteroids because uh, if I shoot right now, I end up shooting the outlaw station when I get too close. It's brutal. Oh my god, this guy's got nip nip buds as well. I'll lose my mind, bro. But there we go. I got a bunch more packets. Let's just pop them open. We're almost full inventory now. Sheesh. It's all this uh technology and whatnot everywhere <laughs> takes up so much room. There we go. We got all of them opened. Let's give and buy any of them that I might want to use myself. Uh, right now, looks good. Okay, so we got a bunch of them to sell. You can see that was like... Okay, so two of the planets that we stopped at had a uh, places for us to pick these up at. And then we stopped at this station. That... Wow. Brings us back up to 14.5k nanites. Decent. Like, I can't complain at all with that. Only thing I can complain about is not having enough to uh, get another slot my companion registers. So, I may get, I might get rid of somebody. Mm. Th this guy, honestly, I'm not a huge fan of. There we go. Abandoned. <laughs> Abandoned that creature. That's wholesome. Let's get out of here. I do want to check out this uh, harsh blue globe down here. It sounds pretty interesting. Maybe we'll find a cool guy on there. All right, here we are. Let's check it out. Uh Oh, damn. It's got these spiky dudes. And then it looks like it looks like pineapple. What the fuck? Okay, maybe, maybe we'll check out Mr. Pineapple creature. I could see him easily having a lot of potential. Yeah, there's one. That out. Ugh. Oh no. I don't wanna I don't wanna take it home, but definitely making note of it. Look at that guy. Like ring down there. Onion ring. That's crazy. Oh, look at this guy. What the fuck? It, it's it's the same kind of plant guy I I <laughs> I kinda want this one more though now. His head looks like a fucking like a threatening glory hole. Uh, yeah. I, I don't know. Damn, dude. There's only so much potential I can I can go with, you know. I already got one. Let's try to find someone else. What is the? Is that just it's just soccer ball? What the hell? No, oh, no. I'll give it creature pellets. Hello there. Chris off extrusion. What is that? Bone nuggets. What, what kind of item is that? Rapid self healing in process. Hmm. I do want to adopt this guy. This is totally a soccer ball type creature. Like this is crack. Can I ride? Nah, I'm not incompatible size. Maybe if he gets bigger, <laughs> you know, you start growing him. Wait, I see induce egg what okay so in 24 hours i'll get an egg from him yo that, that, that's a good find i didn't even know that i could get eggs off of my own uh companion creatures so yeah oh and all though i think we've done pretty damn good today so i've added three new creatures to my roster i made quite a bit of nanites i mean i definitely gotta make some more you know fill out that list but uh yeah <laughs> we definitely know the best way to make nanites i think in game just from scanning down the stuff on this planet like i've been chilling at 160 mil all video I don't know. We made like 50k nanites in like an hour or so. So that's a lot. On top of that, I got more arms packets down here to grab. I love to see it. And are you kidding me? A fucking S class gas cloud as well here? No way, bro. Like, okay. Well, yeah, let's go find that before we leave. Yeah, very easy because we're in like a superheated storm I'm going there right away. And uh, is it like in the water? No, it's like right here or something. What do we got? What do we got? We got uh, oxygen. Oh, no. Do I need another oxygen farm? Not sure if I do. I'll, I'll put down a base computer though, just in case. No, may I, I do know that oxygen is like super useful and like using a lot of crafting. So maybe having higher oxygen output wouldn't even be that bad. Very least though, it's mine. <laughs> because I found it, you know, let's go claim this base. And I'm going to rename this base to a um S-Class Oxygen Second Base, I guess. You know, I'll try to make a distinction for, so I don't end up warping here by accident one day. But there we go. We've made pretty good progress. I'm going to call in my ship and go to the freighter because we got a lot of nip-nip to plant. All right, after selling all of this stuff as well, what are we going to get? Back up to 21k nanites. Fucking cracked insane. That's some good work done there. What What the fuck do you mean I can't go back to my place? Fuck you. But I, I, 
Yeah, I'll teleport to my settlement first, and then I'll go to my freighter. Oh my god. Every time I come back, there's always something attacking it. The fact my settlers aren't convinced that, like, I'm in charge of these attacks, like, I'm doing it just to look good in front of them, fucking baffles me, man. Every time I show up, there's a new attack. All right, almost there. Almost got this fucking piece of scum. <laughs> Oh, there we go. Hard frame engine acquired. I'm going to go and make some uh, decisions. There we go. Now let's go and teleport to our freighter. And then we're going to plant as many nip nips as we can. Here we are. Why do I got extreme radiation inside of my ship? Let's go upstairs. Let's go. We also got these plants to harvest. All right, going up here. Yeah, looks like they're all still growing from the last harvest, but I should be able to plant quite a few of them now. Yeah, we got 18 available to build. That's way better. I might have to hunt Facium, um, you know, because I think we might have more nip nip buds than we got Facium. There we go. Yeah, we got way more plants set up. The room is starting to get there. And I also need Facium for these double cultivation chambers. So yeah, definitely gonna want to get on that. Maybe making some gut rot flowers would help. Those do give me um Facium every four hours. So I'll consider that. But this floor right here, this part is gonna be the nip nip farm, you know. <laughs> Not changing anything about that. We're gonna make sure this whole place filled up with nip nip. But with that, I think I'm going to end off this video on No Man's Sky. If you're enjoying my playthrough, make sure you leave a like, comment, subscribe, check out the playlist and everything else, you know? We're doing some of the coolest content that we can on this game, and there's lots more to come. As always, though, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.